Uh, guys, it's a very special day today. On this day, 1956, an incredible human being was born, a very kind man, a football great and a friend of TalkSport. Well done by Ray Wilkins. Can he finish it? Oh, I say. Ray Wilkins scores for England and a cooler goal you couldn't wish to see. Look at that. The way he looked after himself, the way he trained, the way he played, his attitude to the game, his attitude off the pitch, how he made other people better. He was the man they looked at. He was the guy they learned from. It's going to come out to Wilkins. Wilkins. And it's in. Ray Wilkins with a magnificent strike. As a human being, I don't think I've come across in the world of football, anybody as nice as Ray. And Wilkins has scored one, and that's absolutely magnificent. That's the way I, I prefer to remember him. He's uh, such a nice guy. I keep his smile, I keep his smile, because uh, I always remember that, that little fellow with that nice uh, smile, and uh, I really love him. So today would have been the late, great Ray Wilkins' 65th birthday. Um, we're paying tribute to him today. Ali, uh, you, were in, you were fortunate enough to actually play with him. What was he like as a, as a player and a man? Um, I'll tell you, Ray, Ray was a fantastic footballer. Absolutely fantastic footballer. But a, but a miles better man. He was, an, he, he was one of these guys you meet in your life that leaves such an impression on you. He was an absolute gentleman. Gentlemen, never, never said a bad word about him, and, and I never heard them say a bad word about him. Loved by everybody. I mean, that just tells you what he's like. He, he was loved by everybody, for the tea lady to his centre half to the fan. Absolutely incredible. Somebody sent me a video the other day. He scored a volley against Celtic, Rayman. Honestly, God, mm. that's volley stuck it right in the top corner, and I, I was just looking at him running away, and me and about three others trying to catch him. Right. <laughs> And the look in his face was absolutely unbelievable. I'm just looking here. Listen to us, guys, right? Chelsea, Man United, AC Milan, PSG, Rangers, QPR, Palace. I think he was at Wickham for a while. Hibs, Millwall. I mean, what a set of clubs that is. Yeah. I mean, what a CV. Football CV, as I say. The best football CV MD could hope for growing up. But... An even better, even better fella. I can still see him, Razor, walking into that dressing room, sitting in the corner, and he, he just used to love the crack up there because our, our dressing room was full of madmen, Ray. Lord, it was. <laughs> it was full of complete yeah. madmen. And the wee man used to just sit there and lap it up. He mm. loved it, that wee grin in his face. Brilliant. Sadly, miss. Tragic. Mm. Yeah. You when were I, coach I, yeah, by yeah, I was coach um, in 2004 in a Toulon tournament. Mm. Uh, Dave Sexton was our manager. And obviously, Ray was still playing then. And he came along and he was... What an inspiration. I mean, I, I remember the days when I was watching England back in the day. Brian Robson and Ray Wilkins in central midfield. And, then, you know, you, you used to just love the way they played, you know, with passion. Yeah. And he comes across on the training field as well. The, the, the love, of, love of football. I just, I've just i got the um, the stats here. 694 league games he played, Jeez. which is amazing. I mean, I don't know. With cup games, I don't know. But this is just the league games. 84 caps for England. So he was he was a, a brilliant player, as Ali says. But he was a, probably young Frank Lampard uh, summed it all up there when he was listening to him. He was the nicest man you'll ever meet. Mm. Yeah. And I've been lucky to be in quite a few occasions go out with Ray. And as you said before, he, he, he'll never have a bad, way to, a bad word to say about anybody. And anybody who come up to him, he'd have a good chat with him. Correct. And he was he's just, a, he's just a nice guy. So it's such a shame um, to lose him, Ray. But again, he'd be looking down on us saying, brilliant, you you know, you uh, still remember me. And of course they do. Everybody does. Oh, Chelsea, yeah. Manchester United. As you mentioned, as Ali says about the clubs he paid for, some absolutely brilliant clubs mm. and, um, you know, a great guy. And, and sadly missed. So I'm, I'm really pleased we can do this and yeah. say how good of a, a guy he was and how good a footballer he was. He was also just, um, when you say a gentleman as well, Ali, oh. he was one of the first well people spoken. I met at, at TalkSport. Mm. And um, so welcoming, so inviting, so friendly, wanted to know what you were up to, yeah. how your day was, what you got Caring, planned. he cared, didn't he? Caring, yeah. Mm. Knew everyone's names, never forgot anyone's names. No. Knew everyone behind the scenes, what they did, the job that they were doing, their yeah. role. Um, was just a wonder to be around, just a, a very warm, very kind-hearted man and just um, yeah, very very sadly missed um, so today would have been the late great Ray Wickens 65th birthday been, eh? oh, happy birthday Ray we all love you we're sending you all that love <laughs>
Talk Sport Breakfast with Laura Woods. Monday to Wednesday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.